Hello everyone and a special shout out to all the May 2023 students who are now in the final lap of your CA final or CA inter preparations. With less than a month to go, this is like your power play. And there's a lot of things that you can actually do in this one month to kind of get your coveted prefix or the desired result. Now there's a lot to do, a lot of planning, strategy. Well, to be honest, this is one month where irrespective of anything else, utilize every minute, every minute that you have in studying. So over here, try to maximize the time that you invest in your books, in your effective reading to the best extent possible. Yes, it is not possible to cover everything, to get a grasp on everything. There's a huge margin of error. You do not need to worry. I mean, when we are revising, we always kind of think that, oh, this is a very tough thing. What if this comes in the exam? Well, by and large, when you look at your exam papers, it might sound to be very difficult. However, most of the questions are quite, quite manageable. In fact, you have a huge margin for error. You need to score, I mean, at the base level, you need to score 50. That is going wrong every alternate question and still passing. So you have a huge margin for error. Don't be too harsh on yourself. Back yourself more often. Get those positive vibes. Surround yourself with positive people. It is more a game in your mind, your temperament at this stage. What has to be studied, you are largely done that. Do not touch anything new if possible at this stage. Try to focus and consolidate on your strengths. Keep telling yourself that you will be able to do this. You will be at least giving the best with what you have. Irrespective of the result, remember result is something which is uncontrollable. You cannot really control it. Try to focus on the effort. Try to focus on the process at this point. Do not try to unnecessarily go into that territory where you are trying to doubt yourself. Remember, it's easier for us to say this. However, even when we were at the exams, it was next to impossible to kind of gain that kind of confidence that come what may, I will be able to solve each and every question. No, there is going to be a margin of error. You are a human. There would be certain places, certain areas where you might face difficulty, but that does not mean that that is something that is going to hold you back. You need to kind of Take that within your stride and back yourself. Even the All India Merit holders are going to go wrong at least 30 to 40 percent of their paper. And that is where you need to kind of remember that you need to focus at this stage on your strengths. Try to maximize each and every minute that you have. Don't focus on that coveted 15, 16, 17 hour or 12 hour tag. Take every minute, every hour as it comes and try to make the maximum use of it. If possible, try to keep off social media unless you're watching something which kind of enhances your understanding like a revision video or a concept if needed at this stage. Otherwise, it is only you and the books. Try to stay away from all the social distractions at this stage. You will be able to recover more of this after May. This is a time period which will kind of, uh, which will kind of shape you. Look forward to this when you go back. Uh, maybe a few years later, once you get the COVID attack, this is a period which you will fondly remember the kind of efforts, the kind of amount of preparations that you put in will be will be molding you. Remember the iron, the steel is made in the hottest temperature. You, This is your grinding process. It may sound, it may at some instances appear to be getting a toll on you. However, take every minute as it comes. If you have to study, you have to study irrespective of the ultimate consequence. Do not try to worry about the result. Try to worry about your preparations. Try to try to give positive vibes to your preparations. Uh, there's no magic formula at this stage. The last 25, 30 days, you need to kind of uh, sharpen your skills, consolidate your strength. If possible, get some writing practice where you are able to manage your time, especially for papers like financial reporting, which is inherently a little difficult to complete as compared to the other papers. Get some writing practice, get some, uh, 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 get some time management on your place. At the end, when the exams are nearby, uh, you can focus on the last one and a half days of your study leave or, or of your uh, last day preparations to kind of maximize. But at this stage, use this as the opportunity to kind of this uh, to kind of build your result in a manner you desired. For a lot of you, this is like your final pinnacle. You have been studied for the studying for the last 
20 years or maybe something less or more this is probably the last intense month that you are going to study so let it be the best month let it be a really good memory a really good farewell that you give to the academic world before you get that coveted prefix and keep on working so let the josh be at an all time high and go and crack it study hard be focused and go for the kill good luck and study hard for your May 2023 exams.